Here is a recap of what your chamber has accomplished this past year. When mandated closures began, the Whittier Chamber of Commerce quickly gathered and interpreted information and kept the business community informed. The Chamber actively shared members' news, highlighted essential businesses, including providing needed restaurant and grocery store information, and served as a COVID-19 resource to the entire community. While most businesses were forced to shut down, the Whittier Chamber stepped up with leadership and incredible information. As we moved into the recovery stage, Chamber leaders continued to be the voice of our community and strongly advocated on behalf of our businesses with local, state, and county officials for a pathway to safely and successfully ease restrictions. During this time, the Chamber gathered key community partners and stakeholders to form the Business and Economic Recovery Task Force with the goal to gather information to successfully prepare businesses for reopening. Since its creation, our Burke Group has met weekly to identify and address changing business needs. Just recently, our dedicated task force team switched to bi-weekly meetings with the same goal. This group has been focusing on three areas. Business recovery resources, workforce training, and community engagement. Some of the valuable resources the Chamber has provided this year are Recovery Readiness Toolkit, Whittier Back to Work Resource Center, PPP Webinars, HR Forum, weekly newsletters and emails, and our Open for Business page. The Chamber also worked with community partners and the City of Whittier on the closure of Greenleaf Avenue between Wardman and Bailey to allow restaurants and retailers the opportunity to expand their footprint for maximum occupancy. It was branded the Green Leaf Promenade, and today it provides an opportunity for our uptown restaurants and retailers to recover and survive. We hope to see you in uptown enjoying outdoor dining. In the area of workforce development, the Chamber was proud to partner with members and organizations such as the SBDC, SCORE, SBA, and America's Job Source Center, SASFA to offer free webinars and programs on a variety of topics, such as business boot camp, social media tips, creating an online presence and selling online, mental health, diversity, equity, and inclusion, women in business, on-the-job training, sexual harassment training, in addition, we are most proud to partner with our city to offer and manage the Whittier Small Business COVID Compliant Grant, Whittier Relief Fund. These two grants put a combined total of nearly $600,000 into the hands of small business owners who were suffering because of the shutdowns. To some, this was the lifeline they needed to continue paying their employees and keeping their doors open. Thank you to our mayor and city council for being proactive and for allocating needed funds for our business community. In addition, the chamber continued to help offset costs businesses had to pay due to COVID restrictions by providing free PPE to local businesses. Community engagement is the final component to the task force's recovery efforts. Our small businesses are the backbone of our economy, and the Chamber encouraged residents to support them and keep their community thriving. Members are the heartbeat of our Chamber, and despite the challenging year, we were happy to welcome 42 new members into our organization. We continue to be grateful for our Chairman's Circle members who help shape our community vision and support our ability to strengthen the regional economy. We know you have really missed our in-person events and gatherings. We have too, but the Chamber has been creative and inventive this year, providing online opportunities that allow you to stay connected. 
share ideas with like-minded professionals, build business relationships, and promote your business. We also stayed connected to our community and served as a conduit of information. And finally, we partnered with 14 local chambers and business organizations in the Gateway Chambers Alliance to research and discuss legislation that impacted our business community. The Chamber continues to communicate to our members and the community and share your stories. All of these are examples of how the Whittier Chamber is leading the way to educate, advocate, and connect our members and the community. At the end of our challenging fiscal year, the Whittier Chamber is here and we couldn't have gone through without you, our members. This year has certainly demonstrated that the true benefit of belonging to the Chamber lies in the fact that 100% of our membership receives value without ever having to be involved. On behalf of the board and our staff, thank you for continuing to be part of a Chamber that believes in its city, its community, and its businesses.